Now we'll clear the Lion Turtle package in which we will be keeping all the code that are related to our robot into that package. Okay, so open the terminal, but this time we are not going to open the traditional terminal. We need to install our advanced terminal. So for that we will go to the Ubuntu store and search here Terminator. This is the Terminator. And from here you will be able to install. In my case this is already installed. Open the Terminator. And now we will have to create the package. And we will create the package using this command. Package name is line turtle. Node name should be line turtle underscore info in which we will be keeping some basic information about the line turtle. And hit enter. This will create the package. So well, this is the package right here. We will create a folder that is ESP32 micro pros. This directory will keep the all micro ROS code. Now we will build this. And now we will have to write the code for micro ROS. We will navigate to the example of the MyForos code and we will open the basic subscriber. And in the first step, we are going to control the LEDs using the MyForos. There are two LEDs. So do we have to create two topics to control them? Well, no. I will create just one end subscriber that will we taking the values from the user and uh, if we give it a zero it should turn off both LEDs if we give it one it should turn on the left LED uh, if we give it two it will turn on this right LED and if we give it three it will turn on the both LEDs okay this way we will be saving our memory and our computation power as well and why we are creating the subscriber not the publisher because the micro ROS part will be receiving the information from the user that which LED has to turn on or turn off, okay? And uh, this is the basic code of the subscriber. And we are going to use the int 8 because our number will be smaller, not the bigger one. And this subscriber LED S underscore underscore. This shouldn't be the convention for us. Write the message, the uh, LED's message. And the type is end 8. And let this thing same. Subscription call back. And in here, we will mention 8 and also mention 8. Because we are using the end 8. We are not going to use this built in LED. And here is the node. We will modify this. That's fine. And the subscriber name should be LED and small s and in here we should mention int 8 and the subscriber should be leds underscore subscriber and uh, in the executor you are seeing here one so which is representing the thread the number of thread if we are using just one subscriber it will be one and if we are using two subscriber there will be modif it will be modified to two and if there are some other threads it and it will be changed according to them. And in here, our subscriber is LED subscriber and message LED message. And subscription callback is also LED subscription callback. Now we'll verify it if everything is right. Yeah, this is successfully compiled. So we have to show this topic on our terminal. So what we will do, we have to connect the Microsoft agent. So for that, we will first connect the robot. One thing that you will keep in mind, that if you are connecting robot ESP32 with the PC, then the ESP is getting power from the PC, then you must keep your power switch off. Otherwise, you may get your ESP burn. So this is the warning that you must take into the consideration. Okay, now we have to launch the MicroOS agent. With the serial and minus minus dev fetch usb we are using we can see it from here acm uh, 
tab TTY ACM0 and sure that this can be different. You should, you should see it. And this is trying to connect with the ESP32. But uh, if the ESP32 need a reset, just plug out your USB and plug in. It will be reconnected. I'm sorry. We will have to upload it the code first. Keep the micro ROS off and upload the port now. If your micro ROS node is working, then you will not be able to upload the code. The code is uploaded, now we will run the micro ROS node. This is connected. This is absolutely connected. And now I am going to show the magic of the terminator. Again, it will split vertically. Yes. Pros to topic list. L E D S. This is the topic that we have just created. But ROS to topic club this topic and the message type std and it and the colon data colon zero. Okay, this is publishing. And if I give it like two, does it turn on any LED? No. Currently, it is not turning on any LED. So, we have to mention the LEDs pin. So, LEDs are connected. The left LEDs are is connected at 17 pin. And right LED is connected at 16 pin. We have to modify the code again a little bit. I will mention here left L underscore LED and 17. In this setup, we will also mention here. We have declared that the, these pins are set to the output. When the code will be start, by default, these pin will be high. It means, by default, both LEDs will be turned on. So here is the logic. So we have stored this, uh, the data that is the subscri that subscriber is receiving into this value, very, uh, this variable value. And we have used these switches on this value. If the, this is zero, it will turn both LEDs to low. It receives one. It will just turn on the left LED. And if it receives two, it will turn on the right LED. And if it receives three, it will turn on both LEDs. Okay. So this is the basic switch state, right? So now we can just remove this already existing LED pin from here and from here and from here as well if we will save this core the core must be saved in this folder ESP32 to microroth and this should be in line turtle ESP 32 micro ROV. Okay, this is the name of this code. Close the micro ROV agent and upload this code. Alright, so by default, both LEDs are turned on. Now we will connect the micro ROV agent. It is connected. And we have published two. It has turned on the right LED. Right LED. If we want to turn off both, I will give it zero. Both LEDs must be turned off, as you can see. So the both LEDs are turned off. And if I give it value one, the left must be on. Yes, the left is on. If I give it two, two must be on. Yes. You can also add an argon minus minus one. This will publish it just once. Let's give it three. Both LEDs on. So our LEDs are freaking on micro frost. Congratulations, buddy.